what is going on boys and girls of youtube back at it with the best god series we're doing adc today told you i wanted to wait for mid because my mid is getting buffed a lot on patch day <laughs> on tuesday which would probably be today when this goes live but yeah we're doing adc today and i think the best adc is almost like extremely obvious but also maybe a little surprising to certain groups of players it's sir cern is performing out of this world through the buffs they gave him they reverted his two so the center of it's a cripple again it's amazing for him and his damage potential and his fight potential and then with the new builds and going devos the double the triple life still essentially with the new builds on him is pretty much untradeable and it automatically wins you the lane um your clear is decent so in the 2v2 you could have get out cleared but once it turns into a 1v1 you just have more control because you have more sustain so as long as you know how to hit an auto which you should only be playing adc if you do then you'll be good you'll be ready to go and there's kind of two builds that are out there right now there's a crit build and there's a more just pure auto attack build both work both are very very good uh, i'm gonna go the pure auto attack build because i've run the crit build a couple times on the channel and i want you guys to see both and i also think it's just better on cern in general um the big thing with cern is knowing how to cycle through your one in a team fight and get use out of it so if you don't know um first of all you start your two but if you don't know your one has a healing stance right you get max rank 15 percent more lifesteal a summer stance which is yellow you get 25 more damage on your auto attacks it has a little bit of scaling on it you have a orange stance which is flat protections uh the, that lasts for seven seconds by the way seven seconds and then your last one is a slow 15 percent slow so ideally you want to open with an auto in the autumn decay and then you want to cycle over to either slowing them or healing and kind of just doing that over and over again seven second debuff for 26 flat protections is ridiculous it's very very strong then on top of that remember you have a passive which is a cleave you have a cleave auto attack that does 35 percent of your basic attack damage as an extra you know onto the auto so being in melee range is immensely more clear than not being in melee range but you don't want to get poked so you don't always want to be in melee range you kind of gotta you know trade back and forth that's why i said there's gonna be some groups of people that maybe struggle with playing this god a little bit more than others but realistically you should learn this you should get used to it get comfortable with it and you should just farm everybody with it so like right here see the melee cleaves it's a lot of extra damage you have crazy clear on cern because of it if you're using it especially out of the jungle i mean look at this we we hyper out clear these guys i don't even know where the support is oh the support's looking for a loop Okay. I'm not even worried here. I'm gonna play back a little. I'm taking my dash because they do have a Hercules support. I want to survive. You really don't even need to level your one until a little bit later. Having that flat pen though is valuable. So don't get me wrong. I'm gonna look for a pull here. There it is. We don't care. It's fine. To die. You are nutty. Creeps are here. We're gonna use them. Well, we would have used them, but it's is an army. I'll take the trade. We get first blood. I think my support got it, which is a little stinky, but it's all good. It was a good fight. My support played back there, so it's not being in comms. I can't really blame him, but realistically, when I get pulled and I just sit there face tanking autos, he needs to get up into the thick of the fight maybe shell me a little bit earlier so it's more obvious that we are going to win the trade to them and maybe they start backing off maybe they don't know as much maybe the Izanami doesn't full commit um you also never clear the wave like this dude just did i don't know if he cleared the whole wave but we a little bit of it see he gets it now he gets oh nice kill this guy kill this guy He's taking a ton of creeps. Slow oh, my two didn't go off. No. Unfortunate. Good try. I'm okay with these deaths. This is a crazy lane. The Hercules is going to end up getting punished for this and losing out. This is not me should die. That's a really good gang for my mid jungle. 
I like fighting when I'm in lane because the early game of Smite really doesn't matter too much as long as you aren't fully getting clapped and missing out on too much farm. Oh, is this guy running to me? Am I going to get a kill? Oh, he's going back. I don't even think this dude's paying attention. Nice. I do think that both of those fights could have been won without me dying and potentially is an Ami dying if my Sylvanas was more, you know, he can't body block this an Ami, but he could be more on top of eating a couple of melee autos or just being grouped. So I can't rotate over there. This has to be Sylvanas. I've missed a little too much farm. Yeah, we're just nice try. I was gonna say, I've also not seen a big fat pool yet either. Oh, they, wait. they have a hun bats. Oh, they have the Morgan. I was like, they're level four. How do they have a hun bats? That's too bad. That's too bad. Uh, that's really unfortunate for the boys. We'll be good though. We play it for the late game. We are in ADC. That's all that matters. Like I said, early fighting. It's fun. Doesn't really win you the game. Doesn't determine the game for you. So I'm actually going to level up my one here. So I can start to get that pen online, which I mean, at early ranks, it's kind of low. But it, I mean, having 10 flat pen is, is nice. It's a lot of extra damage. Especially onto a tank like this who only has 10 protections. Other than his base protections. Is this level 5 already? We're just going to back off. They can have the lane. If he wasn't 5 on his Anami, I'd probably fight this, to be honest. They're trying to check my purple. I don't know why. They can see I have it. I'd rather not let the wave go into the tower. Good man Sylvanas is here. His Nami's only five early because she got two free waves because we killed support both times. And then also got two kills. I think, right? She has two kills? Yeah. So she's actually going to be pretty easy to solo in my opinion. Unless she hits every auto and just plays perfect or gets crit early and gets crazy RNG with the early crit. Which could happen. It shouldn't happen, but it could happen. Dude, we're just gonna be aggro. An enemy has been slain. Why am I so good at the game? See me cycling. Always pay attention to that. I want to ward this. There we go. When I'm hitting creeps, I'm just gonna life steal. Just have the extra regen. He's going back for his devo gloves. I'm pretty sure. And since he is, I'm going to power farm this. I'm going to go grab the scepter over here on the left. So we are maintaining, you know, catching up that lead. I guess not maintaining the lead. We're going to catch up. It's going to happen. It's going to clear. We see him. So I want to clear this quickly. I want to play any games. We got that now. So if we can fight on top of him, it'll be good. If he has devos finished, which he does, we need to back. It's fine if he wants to poke. He's just playing around full poke. We're going to play around full sustain. <laughs> Might catch me here. Never mind, he missed. Oh, I missed. No. No, good play from him. Great play. If I hit my two there, I live. Potentially turn. I think he gets a kill here. Two. Two win. Two win. Two win, buddy. His dash is down. Two win. Please. Good play from their ADC. Good rotation. Okay, my Sylvanas is kind of making plays here. I hope this guy doesn't get out. Nice, 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 nice. Good job, boys. I like the rotation. It's a little late. We are slapping, though. We're still top damage. I missed my two there, which was huge throws. And, I mean, we're down 400 gold, so it's not the end of the world. I needed to back anyway. I wish he wasn't doing my purple. Thank you, sir. Much appreciated. They got the Hercules over here. So we're a little down. I'm going to try to hold. He's pushing this wave for me, which is glorious. I'm going to try to hold the wave at my tower here. So what I'll do is I'll let this hit hit me a couple times. Um, kind of just wait for these creeps to get over here. And then I want to hold for as long as possible and just keep the creeps here and make sure he misses out on XP because he should be doing his purple too, which is actually a good thing here. All right. And if he comes up, then we just clear. But he's we want him to miss creeps. So we're going to let these creeps die real quick. Poke him out a little bit. Can't hit an auto, man. Oh, what's wrong with me? Once we have sustain fully online, it should be just kind of free.
This guy's in a predicament now because he's fighting me when he shouldn't be. We use the creeps because he popped his, his cooldown and we back off while he does this. We just clear. We full heal. Okay. Well, now we're, we're just global gang, so that is what it is. My team's not rotating. Team, please. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I have mid and right. I thought that was their, their Thanatos. It wasn't. That was their Morgan. So that's unfortunate, but it's okay. It is what it is. We're going to go into XE next. I need to ward up, I guess. I don't think I, I wouldn't have a ward on gold anyway. So there's no way I stopped that gank from happening. But my team shouldn't be getting 3v4 at the tower line right now. Kind of rough. Kind of rough, dude. And he ended up getting the kill. So this is going to be really bad for me now. I need help. Come on, guys. I need you over here. I need you to not sit mid. Unfortunate. Unfortunate, boys. This is going to be a hard match for me now. A really, really hard match for me. I can't believe the mid laner rotated over there it was a good rotation from him don't get me wrong it was smart my team's like taking some weird fight in mid i have to just focus on farming now i'm not gonna be able to rotate and if they rotate over again with another global thanatos ult which i, I mean i could try warding gold like i mentioned but i don't think it's gonna matter we're gonna use our two for damage to try to full commit to one more fight probably one more 1v1 because i was winning that 1v1 that 1v1 he lost it it was over i was full health he was going to lose it uh, it was just really, really unfortunate that their mid laner rotated and ganked. Good job for my team, though. Oh, <clears throat> you guys saw nothing? That wasn't me. That's what happens when you don't play Smite for a couple days. See if this is up. It is. Nice. I'm coming where? Left, right, mid. All right, this is good. Oh, nice. Um... Mid's here. Mid right. Again. <clears throat> They're putting a lot of damage in a hurricane and, and not doing anything with it, so I'm just gonna clear. My my mid laner backed. So I guess that just is what it is. I'm gonna play back here. Don't know where the Hercules is. Don't know where that mid laner went. Don't even know if the mid laner ulted. So could see a Thanatos ult. Nope, they're all mid. They're all my Sylvanas in mid lane. This guy's a two-level loot, so this is gonna be a really, really weird fight for me. I missed. That's not good. He's gonna kill me here. Unfortunate. He wins these trades no matter what. I can't actually win these fights. So sad. It's gonna be a hard game for me. I need to stop challenging him. Oh, he's triple life steal. So he actually matched my life steal, and I didn't even realize it. Bad play for me. Good thing for the team, though. So I'm one in five. We're even gold, right? The game's even gold. We're fine. Because I already know I'm going to be good late game. His late game is actually extremely hurt by building this. And if I went the crit build instead, I could actually counter it by getting Shadow Steel Shuriken and getting anti heal. I want to go the auto attack build because I haven't done a video on it. But if I was trying to win this game, if this was a sweaty game, I would 100% swap over. I would build Shadow Steel and just win off of having anti heal. 100%. Did he do this? Yeah, unfortunate. We get up some wards. They're not going to do much for me. And I'm going to last it again. And we'll see what we can do. I didn't realize. You see, he has a full Devils and he had Aussie there. So he has triple lifesteal. It, it, it literally shatters me. There's no world where if, if he even hits like half the autos, he'd probably still outtrade me. Which makes sense. Because he is ahead. We have a little bit of sustain, which is good. But he just hits too hard. I'm dead. He might die. Yes, let's go. I needed that kill. That's a huge kill for me. I just got so much gold. Oh my gosh, I just got so much gold. <laughs> I actually just got a ridiculous amount of gold there. Holy crap. So if I was 
ahead. Actually, you know what? I'm going to swap this up. I'm going to go Kins. Because I was behind, I wasn't going to go Kins. I was just going to go into the Exe. But Kins is a way better item to have at this stage. And we're actually in an okay spot. We lost tower, but I'm, I should be able to get my purple. I'll get a couple waves. And my team is still fighting in mid. Nice, boys. Nice, 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 nice. Good job. Fire? I mean, you, you guys got you guys got options. You got, you got two objectives, boys. <laughs> like, three objectives. Hello? This is an Ami hit so hard right now. I have to hit my dash on her, and I can kill her. If I can avoid the, the slow or, and then just turn, it'll be beautiful. Yo, this is huge. This is going to get me back in the game. Nice job, guys. Oh my gosh, we almost lost it because my Humbats decided to leap away into the Oracles. Would not recommend doing that. They were coming in for a rotation. You're dead. And you also just decided to stop hitting that. All right, we're gonna get out of here. We don't want to fight this dude yet until we have our full devos, and I can guarantee getting a dash off for damage. Also, kind of with the Aegis, but I almost don't want to go Aegis. I kind of want to go Shell. But Aegis is just massive because they have a Thanatos, so I have to go the Aegis. I hope that eventually they decide to remove Aegis from the game or just nerf it to a point where you don't really want to build it, except for like very, very specific situations. I'm okay with sitting on my tier 2 tower and even holding the wave here and making this Izanami rotate. We will, like, if he wants to leave and go do something, more power to him, right? Like, let him. Because I need to get back in the game. What's gold looking like? Yeah, he's up 1,200 gold on me, so we're just going to chill here. We'll chill here, last hit as much as possible, keep the wave up so he's missing XP and has to rotate around, and then I can counter-rotate as long as I know where he's going. So this is kind of how you play from behind. When you have a bad laning phase or... You get ganked a bunch or whatever it is. Realistically, for me, I got screwed by that mid laner rotating and my mid laner just getting dove under the tower on cooldown right now. Um, I'm probably going to clear this and rotate. Because my Izanami's there. Yeah. They're dying. It's, it's just the Poseidon. This Poseidon isn't playing poorly, but he's not playing as good as he should be. Can we? I don't even want to rotate in here. It's just me and the support. This is almost a bad rotation. I'm kind of going to back out. I don't know why Sylvanas isn't calling where the mid is going. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. We heard a dash. I'm uh, wondering if he's in the smoke. I'm confused. I'm really confused right now. It's all good. I'm, I'm just so lost. All right. I want to hover around here if they go for any big objectives. My wave and right is heavy pushing. There's a tsunami, so we're good there. We're fully stacked. They did pyro. Could we do fire? I'd love to fight now that I'm here. But of course, now that I'm here, I think we want to back off. I'm going to try to Zerg left. Me sitting in right is just... Ooh. This could be big. Oh, the, the play. I'm going to get... There we go. We don't want to hit him anymore. We want him to transform. He's super low, dude. Hunbats backed off. Unfortunate. I thought Humbats is going to cut under and try to fight. That didn't happen. We'll rotate back to mid. It sucks our ult signed up for this team fight. I would love to have ult for this team fight. Defend right lane. Thanks. Telling him to defend right. I'll hold mid. Make sure everything's covered. Got a nice little cripple on him. There's Thanatos. Thanatos ulted. Humbats had a fat ult right there, honestly. Doing as much damage as I can. We're just face tanking this guy. We don't even care. We should win this fight. I don't understand why we're not gripping. This should be a good fight. Come on, boys. Triple this guy. Get a nice little kill. I am hitting really hard. Izanami should be here soon. Full health. We're all good. We can get our Xy now. And we'll shred these tanks. It really sucks not going the crit item, though, to, to anti-heal the Vamana. I really wish I could just get some anti-heal up on him. We're going to focus on getting this tower real quick. There we go. Nice. Playing for left mids and farm. Fighting is really bad. 
there's a lot of farm about to come up. We got neutrals in mid. You got gold coming up soon. Pyro will be up soon. Would have been nice to take their Scorp. I think he's okay in mid. Let's, let's see. Yeah, we have so much healing. I'm going to back off. I'm not going to upgrade this yet. You don't need to upgrade this really anytime soon. We're going to go to Oboe next. And then we're going to go from Oboe into Silver Branch. That's going to give us max percent pen. Pretty much be just railing the... Oh, no. He's, he's dead to the Thanatos ult. Come here. Oh, nice. Oh, not nice. Nice. They're so low. I didn't miss that one. Yeah, we all trade now, buddy. What's going on, bud? That's not good. I'm just going to run away and use my Aegis here if I have to. Come here, I got you. I got your deal. No. Can you just AFK under the tower? No! Come on! Poseidon, please! Nice! There we go, buddy. Good play. That was a good pull from the Hercules. He debated me pretty hard. I was trying to get him with the sidestep, but he was super patient. But realistically, if Poseidon is playing correctly, he steps up when the Hercules pushes me, and then he has to back off because he's crippled. Is what it is. We, we, we've seen that the Poseidon isn't playing terribly. But he isn't really playing for the team at all. He's kind of just running around throwing abilities out. Are they on this? Nah, we're good. Nice. Grab some wards. We'll get back in this game with one really big team fight, realistically. And we'll be chilling. So he's going crit on his Nami, but he's going a bad crit build. He's going Rage Deathbringer, which is super awkward. I will be able to trade him. Oh, leap over the wall. Leap over the wall. What? No? I don't know why he didn't commit to that leap over the wall. That's a kill. Come on, boys. You're getting played. Getting kited way too much. I almost want to go split out right. But I know we'll lose. They could be on gold. I have to go over here. Okay, you'll see what's going on. See if they're on this. He can solo this very easily. With the crit and the triple lifesteal. It's just pretty free. Kind of why I like going the crit build on this for the casual and rank games. Oh, that's a bad fight. I don't know why we stayed around that long. I will not be there, boys. Yep. What are you even doing? Bad fight. It's a really super extended fight. They're they're low-ish, but we're all dead. Which is the problem here. He's dead. Um, I might be able to contest them at fire if they go for it. They should. They are going for fire. Well. Wow. All right. I don't want them to get this for free, but I'll probably die contesting this. Completed. I can be crazy greedy here. Always be aware of your surroundings. May you find delight in the screams of your enemies. Ooh, that was close. That was about as close as it gets. Whew. For having just seeing that little bit of health, man, that had to have been so close. We're in a, we're still okay. We're still okay. It's 17-19. I'm not worried being behind. I'll be fine. The later this goes, the better. I do a lot of damage. Their front line's really, really strong. And I don't know if we have anti-heal. Yeah, we don't have our anti-heal online. This is the issue right now. You gotta go anti-heal early. You can't wait till 20 minutes. You need to have it at, you know, 12, 13, 14 minutes. This is really late to be building an anti-heal. Um, I want to go into the rest of my oboe, but I don't think I can afford to because their front line's so tanky. So I'm gonna try to rush this silver branch. Finish the Silver Branch. If I can get it before the game's over, we win. Bad fight. Bad fight. Bad fight. Bad fight. Bad fight. Nice peel from the boys. No anti-heal to kill this guy unless we have Ankh. And I don't think we have an Ankh. Oh, we do have an Ankh. Nice. I can't hit an auto. Nice play. Huge. Huge. We're in a good spot to push right now. The mana has no ult. We got some picks. Everyone's healthy. This is where we catch up. Just got to not get quadruple stunned or CC'd by the, the Morgan. He might be on red buff. Or even mids. Oh, he's sitting around gold. I'd like to do this. 
We have a lot of life steal. If we could just do this, it'd be sick. Please. Trying to focus the tower. We know he's gonna run at us like this. It's fine. Oh, he didn't stay. Why are we running away? Why is my front? <clears throat> Kill him! I guess a Groot! Nice. Gotta watch out for the execute. I wanna go heal. If Sylvanas plays tower there, we can fight and get the tower. I don't I don't know why he was afraid to play up. It's all good. We end up kind of throwing away their fire. Gold is up. I'm gonna help on gold. I wanna go push out right for farm, but it's smarter to go for gold here. Hopefully my Poseidon just saves saves his one for secure. Oh, Kraken for secure. Wait, we had Kraken still in a team fight? <laughs> We definitely take the fight on the tower there, and the reason is we're up, it's three to five, right? They have Nova Mono Alt yet. We're in a good spot for a team fight. If we get a pick, then it goes back to three versus five when they respawn, and we can just keep pushing. Like you continue having that advantage. Instead, we're kind of on the back foot. Their Hercules luckily through. So that's nice for us. Uh, now we're in a spot though where we can go and get our silver branch. We have a lot of pen and we'll finish the oboe afterwards, and then finish our starter. And our starter is gonna go to Death Temper. If this isn't a perfect example, like realistically showing you guys this video, it's gonna be like, oh, we can get in farm. Their ADC played great, 100%, played great. But the early game doesn't matter. Playing great in the early game doesn't mean shit. You can't be like, oh, I beat you in the early game. That's not a thing. There's no early game. The early game isn't a separate video game. We're in the same match. The late game is all that matters. And this is an example of you can get to late game and do whatever the hell you need to do every game. No matter how bad the match is. Like, that dude was diving me under the tower. I got a big pick on him. I was getting ganked, whatever. But, like, you could still... Like, we fight this. We fight this. Fight! Please! Please! Yes! The triple life steal, baby! I gotta run. I gotta run. He missed! No! The life steal, baby! The life steal! I can't hit this guy. He's so fast. I'm gonna heal off of this. The life steal, dude. The Thanatos used everything to try to trade me. Morgan ult. This is a ridiculous. This is not. <gasps> One? Nice. Huge, huge, huge. We should have killed the Morgan. I don't know what my hunt bats was at mid camps. We saw the Morgan walking over a ward and he just didn't go on him. That actually blew my mind. Like I, I am, I am lost. Thanks for giving us the ward. What in the world? You should never have done that. I don't even care if they have another ward to get here. You should have kept that vision. You just heard him TP. Yeah. Fight this, please. Okay. I don't know what's going on here, man. My team is trolling me really hard. We end up winning this, which is good. Easy triple. Told you we'd be back in the game, baby. I told you we'd be back in the game, baby. It's all about the late game. I'm tanking. I don't know why. Gotta reset this. I can't keep tanking. I'm going to go lifesteal over here real quick. We do have a lot of healing, so it should be fine. But the, the lifesteal in this kit, and I'm not even full. I don't have temp death temper yet. So you get a, oh, I guess not full, not full build. Um, don't have the death temper yet. Don't have the oboe finish yet. Sitting on 3k gold. Have these dudes running at me. I don't know what's up with my team being so afraid of pulling fire there and just killing the first person to come in, but you know, it's fine. We end up winning the fight. Can't complain too much. We don't have enhanced switch stinks, but we have a lot of abilities up. We have Humbat's up, ult up, my ult up. I think Poseidon ult up should be up in a second. If I felt safe, I'd play in melee range on the tower to get the extra damage, but... 
we just back here i'm gonna go take the blue because it's here and then i'm gonna back spend my gold get my starter get my oboe be full build and then we just run down right and, and win the game no reason to stay in the jungle right now it's super greedy because they're gonna look for something you need to back so we got the death temper red pot uh i'm actually gonna upgrade my beads here in case this goes into a longer game and we're gonna go right i don't want to get picked <laughs> it is what it is man you get the triple kill the free fights uh where you have more gold now than there is an ami there is an ami's a crit build so he actually doesn't do as much to my tanks we're just in a good spot kind of just staying in lifesteal stance for most of the fights too especially there the the devos plus the passive plus the death toll really kept us alive for a lot longer than we should have been See, that, that's what you do, boys. You win games. You carry games. It doesn't matter how far behind you end up in the early game. Late game, you carry games. You don't play scared because your teammates are scared. You don't play dumb because your teammates are dumb. You get those kills. I probably could have dashed in and killed the Hercules too, but you know what? My team wasn't supporting me. My teammates haven't been around me. My teammates don't want to play with me. So guess what? I'm going to do what I, what I need to do. I'm going to carry the game. I'm literally winning the game. I don't I don't know what else I can do here. We're doing gold theories and stuff instead of just pushing and getting more phoenixes when you already have a phoenix. You get all the phoenixes here. You play smart. Going for the end is not a bad thing, but you could just play smart, so you might as well. There's no point on uh, greeting it. Plus we have fat waves. Poseidon's not even here, by the way. He hasn't been here this whole time. I just missed. I'm trolling. I'm just trying to the Phoenix. Free kill. Pretty much just killing everybody. Get a fat little Aegis off. Unfortunately, we have no... Uh... Oh! Nice job! <laughs> the woohoo. That was rude. Okay. I respect this. They're being really. Look at how much damage. That's their, their t support tank, by the way. Everyone just getting melted, bro. This game. GG. We'll end up to with 12 kills. This game is insane. GG. That build slams. It felt like I was critting. That build is 500 damage and obo to that ADC. Three, dude, that build does so much damage. Goodness gracious. I'm sure they were hyped up that they shut me down early game because I was like one in five or something or two and seven, I think, at my, at my lowest. End up with, uh, was it 12 kills, 13 kills? <laughs> Told you, late game. I tell you guys this. Play for the mid to late game. Don't play for the early game. 12 and seven, I end up. I did 15, 14k more damage than their ADC. Who went 11 and 7. No assist, by the way. He did well in lane. He outplayed me in lane. But I outplayed him in the game. And outplayed him in the team fights when it mattered. That's why CERN, to me, is one of the best ADCs in the game. Self-peel, good turn potential. Melee damage is extra. So, you know, assassins are on you. Get that extra damage. And really, ADC roll in general is just nuts. Late game, you're kind of unmatched. That was a full auto attack build that felt like I was critting the like I was chunking the, the, support, the support Hercules that support Hercules was sitting on full defense like a lot of health and a lot of defense actually he was kind of squishy but he had a lot of health uh he did have a lot of health so that Kins was slamming him so hopefully you guys liked the video if you did hit the subscribe button let me know what you thought of the game in the comments I'm sure most of you were like we get getting shit on well no we don't get shit on around here all right <laughs> hope you guys have a good day make sure you like the video as well i will see you in the video later tomorrow the next day the next day and the next day